Hello Leo and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Special people like you make every day great. See, this is what I'm talking about, right? Special people like you make every day great. You are smart, you are beautiful, you are caring, and I love you. If you want to be somebody, if you want to be somebody, somebody really special, just be you. That's nice. This is what spirit wants you to know. Okay, you're very special to them. You're smart, you're beautiful, you're caring. Repeat it. Put it in the comment section. I am smart, beautiful, and caring. Okay, you are loved out here, collective. Okay? And I mean, right now, there's just so much chaos and drama going on out there. I really just wanted, I wanted you guys to hear some kind words from God. Okay? May you experience the love of Christ, uh, though it is too great to understand fully. Um, I thank God for you and always mention you in my prayers, okay? Um, and I do too. I thank God for you guys. I, you know, um, the collective energy is always in my prayers every morning when I get up, okay? Before I do my readings, um, may you be filled with joy today, okay? So just know that you're very special to the divine. You are smart. You are beautiful. You are caring. That's what God thinks of you, okay? All right, so let's see what else comes out in the reading. I'm hoping for some warm messages. Ooh, hoo. ten of cups, ten of pentacles at the split. <laughs> Thank you, spirit. Thank you, spirit. Um, you're about to be blessed in a huge way for whoever this is for. You're getting ultimate wish fulfillment. That's at the split you get the ten of cups and the ten of pentacles. Um, these are like the two best cards in the deck, really. Um, holy cow, that's wish fulfillment. Yeah, see, look at this. And the people who have tried to ruin things for you, the ones who have tried to betray you, right? They can't. They, can, they can't ruin any of this for you. This is what spirit is rewarding you for being so special and so wonderful, okay? Okay. Uh, whatever you have is is here to stay. This is a solid foundation. You know, I'm just seeing this person as like a wolf, right? I'll huff and I'll puff, and I'll blow your house down, right? No, they can't. Yours is built too solid. You've built a solid foundation here for you. This is a happy time in your life, and Spirit wants you to have all of this, and they want you to celebrate it as well. I feel like um, this is like the wolf standing on the outside looking in, okay? They can't get in. Yeah, and if they try anything, if they try anything tricky to try to stop all of this for you, karma is going to dance on top of them. These people are under God's feet right now, okay? They are. They're under the divine's feet right now. They can't, um, they can't make a move towards you. Boy, do they want to. You know, I'm not going to lie. They, they want to. They could be secretly planning some way to, to block you from going on your path. Okay, there's that wolf. What did I say? A wolf. There it is right there. Boom. <laughs> Thank you, spirit. Yeah, but if, those, if this wolf tries anything, they're going to be brought down. Okay, you get this new beginning, a wish granted. Yep, a lot of wishes granted. The Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles, that's the kind of life everyone dreams of having, okay? Yeah, and the, the, whoever this is, they can't do anything. They're bound. They're stuck, okay? This is also see, uh, someone seeing things from a new perspective, they're watching you. They're being forced to watch you, I feel. They, they, can't, um, they can't do anything to stop you, though. And they're getting their karma for the things that they've tried to do to stop you already. Okay? Yeah, they're under major judgment. Spirit is bringing you to calmer waters. They've seen everything these people have done to you. 
okay you have been betrayed a couple of times okay you've had a you've had swords stuck in your back by maybe even a group of people several people spirits um saying come with us you know we we're going to get you to calmer waters you get to have a new beginning you get to move forward and put this all behind you okay and now the whoever this is over here now they're suffering they're suffering a lot of heartache sorrow judgment karma Ooh, you're about to get new love too as well Ooh, and it's an emperor <laughs> Oh, collective, you're about to be loved the right way by somebody who knows how, okay? Um, and I feel like, yeah, um, yep, yeah, I'm hearing the arms you leave lonely won't wait forever. You know what? That's why I'm here, because I worship the woman you walked on, right? I don't know who sings it. It's a country song. I don't know. Uh, but that's what I'm hearing. So somebody's coming in who's going to treat you the right way. Um, yeah, something about, um, um, and I'll try to write all you did wrong. Yeah, they're going to write everything that this person did wrong. Okay, everything. And they've done a lot. Yeah, um, I, they're not going to like this at all when this new emperor steps into your life. And you're about to get love the right way. This this reading um, has me really pumped, like for real. I so needed a positive, a more positive reading today. <laughs> so I'm very grateful. Yeah, you've had nothing but integrity. You've been nothing but honest. You've, um, you've got your boundaries up right now, and you're standing your ground. You've had nothing but strength here. And I feel like um, you're about to get someone new, a leader. This person's going to be a leader, a leader in something, maybe a leader in their field. They could be a boss, a business owner, um, somebody who's very strong, somebody who's going to be loyal and dedicated to you and protect you. Okay, ooh, ooh, collective, I love this. Yeah, and they're going to wife you up, and you're ready for love. Look at this, ooh, oh my gosh. You're getting, the, you're getting the emperor. It's the king of pentacles to the queen of pentacles. This is an ideal match for you. This is somebody with possibly a, a lot of money as well. Like I said, boss energy. Um, business owner kind of energy. This um, this new person could be a Leo. Or, or, why do I say Leo? Um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You could be a Tor Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, Leo. There's the Leo. Thank you. Leo, uh, Virgo. Yeah, this person could be a Leo. Yes, they could. They're definitely a leader. You're about to get new love, and it's uh, this is a queen of pentacles to the king of pentacles, you guys. This is the ideal match for you. Okay, very grounded, stable. This is a commitment here, and you're ready. You're ready for love. You've learned all of your lessons, passed all your tests, all the way through the tarot deck. Now you're ready for that last pentacle, and that last pentacle stands for the right love for you. Boom! It's right here. <laughs> Oh, and your person from your past, there's no way they can compete with an emperor. There's no way they can compete with this king of pentacles. And they're stuck. I feel like they're stuck in some kind of spiritual prison. They could actually end up going to jail here for something. Okay. Um, but yeah, they're not going to be able to come forward. They're not going to be able to get you back at this point. Um, this person from your past, they could have body tattoos. They could have like a big tattoo on one of their legs. They could be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Look at this. I kind of get the sense that, um, I feel like this is your energy, both, both your energy. There's a person over here that wants you. They're going to be very emotional. Um, 
very upset, right? Unable to come towards you. They're seeing you as their match. They're going to be having a lot of, all they're going to be left with are the memories, okay? And those memories are going to, um, it's going to really affect them on the inside. Uh, they're going to be feeling very heartbroken, okay? They're going to remembering, they're going to be remembering how loving you are, how loving you were to them. You could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. I feel like this is this person thinking about you. And I feel like this is a new person coming in to wife you up or husband you up. Take it how it resonates, okay? I feel like, too, there's something about you teaching this person how to love, okay? If you look at this really closely, we've got you, the Queen of Cups. This is the most loving, nurturing, kind, um, most um, intuitive queen in the deck, okay? Doesn't matter if you're a water sign or not, all right? But look at the cup. It's very ornate, like you're a master at love. You know how to love. And look at this person's cup. They have a cup now, but it's a starter cup, okay? Do you see what I'm saying? It's more like a starter cup. You taught this person everything you know about real love, and they're realizing that, okay? You taught them. This is like teacher and student. So, you know, just know this. As you move forward in this new connection, or in this, yeah, this new connection, um, and this new cycle, you're leaving this, per this person from your past. They may be upset. They may be trying to ruin you, but boy, did you teach them about love. Because that you know what? I feel like this person, their life is loveless, okay, without you. And they're feeling that absence. They just, they really don't know what to do about it. And they don't want to see you getting with anybody new. And they're jealous about your glow up, okay, and all of your abundance. But this person's kind of a mess, okay? That's how I would describe them. Yeah, see, uh, you taught them about love, though. They're going to feel so much pain when you get with this new emperor. Okay? They're always going to be thinking about the one that they can't have, and that would be you. This person's going to suffer, suffer, suffer. I'm telling you, this is their outcome the Nine of Swords and the Ten of Swords. They're going to be stuck in their mind. They're going to be losing sleep over this. They're going to be all kinds of stressed out because you're going to be getting loved by someone else. They're going to be feeling a whole lot of pain. This is like the most pain you can have here. Yeah, but you're moving on. I mean, you're, you're you know, you, what are you supposed to do? You're not going to keep your life on hold for someone, and you're not going to allow someone back in who's going to betray you the way they, they try to betray you all the time. Okay? So, of course, you're going to get with someone else. Like, I mean, this person is this person's just weird. You know, uh, they're, they're kind of both a hater, a jealous hater, but yet at the same time, they don't want to let you go, okay? Yeah, you're, you've got other options, man. And even if they do apologize, which I feel like they want to, I don't think you're going to accept it. You're sitting here with, I mean, you'll accept their apology, but you won't accept them back. You may not even want to hear their apology anymore, honestly, because you've, you've got a headset on, your arms are crossed, your eyes are closed. You're not looking at them. You're not talking to them. You're not budging. They've hurt you too many times or you've been hurt by too many people. Some of you, for some of you, you're not even interested in love right now. Huh? You're very busy building something successful for yourself. And you've been hurt too many times. Some of you have been shown other options already. Um, and you kind of don't want them. But I'm telling you, though, when this King of Pentacles comes in, you're going to want them. 
this is literally um i feel like this person here is your match you know a lot of you are are being uh, you're using your discernment which you should you know use your discernment with everyone who approaches you there could have been up to three people who have been interested in you and no you're just like no no not that one not that one not that one but wait till this emperor comes in and they're coming in fast thank you divine that energy is coming in i feel like a lot of people are interested in you right now <laughs> uh who wouldn't be because you're what you're smart you're beautiful and you're caring okay yep who wouldn't want that? Mm-hmm. And you're sexy. Queen of Wands energy. You're every queen in the deck here, really. So you're in Empress energy. You have an emperor coming in. That's a power couple. A queen of pentacles, a king of pentacles. That's a power couple. Okay? And your person, they get the nine of swords and the ten of swords. But they've learned a lesson from you about love. Okay. Ooh, collective. I'm loving this reading, though. Um, all right. So what else can you show me for my beautiful collective? Thank you. Peace. Change. I feel like your life is going to be very peaceful after this. Look at, there's your emperor. There's the new one. I'm telling you, you have new love coming in. And it's a power couple. Um, yes, use your intuition though, right? Use your, that's what you're doing. You're, you're, you're getting new love offers and I feel like you're passing them up until you reach this emperor, okay? But a big change is coming in your love life. Your life is about to change in a big way. I mean, your first two cards out are the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. So, yeah, um, your life is about to change in a massive way. Um, and you're about to get the kind of love that you deserve. It's, it's going to feel like a very magical time. That's what it, this is going to feel like. I'm getting the chills up my legs. They're showing me... Um, they're showing me the wheel of fortune, right? That's like, that's mysterious. It's magical. You know how the universe works, right? How, how you can, um, you can pray for something and it comes to you. I feel like that's what you're doing here too. You know, manifesting. It, it's going to be like a magical shift, a huge change in your life. Okay, so... Yeah, just get ready, collective. Some of you could even be making a house move, a location change, or maybe even taking a vacation. That could be where you meet this new person. <laughs> oh, I love this reading for you, though. Anything for 